Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much once again for clicking on this video. With us again, we got Chase, the sweet little Cavalier Spaniel. Guys, the problem with these guys is the ears. We, uh, we tend to really overlook what happens with these Cavalier Spaniels and their, their ears. And I'm gonna show you what the problem is, is they just have like way too much hair going on in their ears. Um, and although this is really meant for their protection and everything, uh, after a while it just starts to mat up and really cause a problem. They can barely see the ear canal because it's just so covered with these mats. You can see these mats just forming right where the ear canal is. So we got to clear this out just so that the ear can breathe a little bit better. Um, you know, the ear seems to be okay. It's not infected or anything, but it's really, really dirty only because, you know, again, it's just, there's so much moisture buildup. It's not breathing and we got to clear some of this stuff out. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Okay guys, so we're just going to show you this, uh, his left ear here, because it's going to be the same process on the right ear we're using the, uh, Andis five speed Excel clipper here on this with a 10 blade. So I'm just going to turn it on and position him and gonna try to get right to the source. We have to be very, very careful because we got that flap of skin we always talk about and it's like right in here, but I'm not gonna even go there yet. We're gonna kinda just tread lightly here and just clear out a little bit there just to get them acclimated to it. Kind of going all the way around. It's okay, buddy. You need to be really careful when doing this, guys. You don't want to grab skin. We don't know what's going on under here until we actually get to it and start clearing out. So you can see already how much the ear canal is more visible. in there with this 10 blade okay so I'm gonna stop for a second because I really do I want to identify exactly where that ear flap is because I don't want to cut it guys that happens a lot you know um, you could see that I'm like tapping with the 10 blade instead of just you know going full force trying to go like this I'm tapping little bits at a time just like that you see? And a lot of this just connects all behind the ear too. So we got all this stuff back here. I'm just gonna hit that because that's all matted anyway. And you know, it gets covered up nicely. You see here? And now we can start to see that flap more and more. It's like right here here I think very hard to see guys and don't assume that all dogs are the same every Cavalier I do you know the ear flap could be here it could be up here uh, all dogs are different so don't ever assume that it's the same for every dog uh, even though they're the same breed it can be very very different but now at least you can see you know we can get into that ear canal and we can clean out that ear real well now. And it's gonna breathe more now, now that all that hair is gone. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna take this down too. And uh, you know we're gonna trim up his ear and take a lot of this hair out. He's real matted all over. He's got big mats in his chest. So we are gonna give him a short haircut. But again, we're just going to just clean up this ear, let that ear breathe, and it's just gonna stay healthier and it's going to avoid an infection by doing this. Okay guys, so just to preview what we said, we're going to just put on, a, I have a, this is a 30 blade. It's a real strong, uh, durable 30 blade that I made myself. I only use it for snap-on combs. I really don't do much else with it. Uh, other than snap-on comb and I'm using a number four wall uh, snap-on comb or guard whichever you guys choose to call it so we're just gonna pop that on and again we're just gonna do some more clearing I'm gonna come right on top of the ear like this just come down and just get get a lot of this hair off 
And we're going to do the same thing on this side too. But again, we're just focusing on this side. And then I'm just going to come down in here, clear out this whole section. And now that you have the guard on, you don't have to worry too much about the ear flap. You can kind of just blend off. Still, still be careful. You don't want to catch it on the wrong angle. So you just, this right here is the ear flap, so go with it. And nice and gentle, you want to finesse it. You don't want to, uh, you don't want to come down on it in, a, in the wrong direction or come up on it. You want to feel it, it's going that way, so you're just going that way, going with, with the grain of hair. And there you go, it's all cleared out. So take a look on this side, what, what we looked like, you know, that we just left and See all of that? It's just a mess. It's all matted. You know? So this is going to help the dog out, guys. He's going to feel a lot more comfortable. You know, and again, avoid, avoid those infections and in the, in the big mat buildup in here. See that? Nice and clean. And, and he likes it too, because you get in there, give him a good scratch now. Right, Chase? Right, buddy? Right? You go, boy. You go, boy, Chase. <laughs> You're so freaking cute. These calves are just adorable little dogs, you know. Go, boy, Chase. Okay, guys, so that's going to do it for this video. Again, thank you so much. If you enjoyed this video or it helped you in any way, please do us a big favor, hit the like button and subscribe if you're new to our channel, and we will see you in the next video.